Ah, oh, we have found thee. Word reached us of thy recovery, and thus did we gather with all haste. Ah. By thy looks I gather thou hast gleaned that which I came to tell thee. Orionje has shared everything with us. The Exarch's true identity and purpose. I offer no excuses. When I agreed to aid the Exarch with his plans, t'was in full acceptance of the condemnation I would face when my duplicity was laid bare. Yet it is not rancor, but resolve that I sense in thee. Thou art fully intent upon walking thy path to its end, art thou not? If thou canst forgive my deception, or Failing that, set aside thy displeasure for a time. I do beg leave to follow thee. What strength and wisdom I possess are thine to command. I thank thee. Doubt not, but that I will do all in my power to repay thy kindness, and fulfill the Exarch's wishes. I'm sorry, but I don't think this is a good idea. Leaving the Crystarium, I mean, with or without Urianche. What I did for you won't last forever. There's no telling when the light will break free again. Please, you must stay here. At least for a little while longer, we will find a way to cure this, I promise you. How can you make promises? We don't even know where to start. Alize, please. You know Reen was only trying to help. I know! I know only too well! But making promises you have no way of keeping is not a kindness. It's a lie. Plain and simple. We've all searched high and low for an answer, and every one of us came back empty-handed. I am not about to stand in her way now. Not after failing her in her hour of need. No. The least we can do is... We will go with you as well. There is naught to be gained by standing still. Indeed, we have exhausted every other avenue. Lead and we shall follow. If there is any hope to be found, then we will surely find it at your side. Are we all in agreement then? Is there aught we can do to help? Though we may not know the whole story, we do know you're in for a fight. And while the Exarch's away, it falls to the rest of us to see the Warrior of Darkness is given a proper send-off. You told them! No. Well, not in so many words. Oh. Aye, we didn't need it spelled out for us. When the night sky appeared over whichever place you went to, it was harder not to put two and two together. Locker there. From the moment I heard that you and the Exarch once, the once, uh, give him a cutscene. I had my suspicions. Long had he been waiting for a certain someone to arrive, and I knew at once that it must be you. 
Exactly. When he went up to meet you, to was clear it was no ordinary visitor. That spring in his steps spoke volumes. I could feel his excitement. We do not fully understand where you or the Exarch hail from, or why you've all done so much to protect us. But we are deeply grateful nonetheless. So, if there is anything at all we might do to aid your journey, you need only name it. What would you have of us? You might have invited them to join us, where there are not so many. Come, they are waiting. What is your will, O oh warrior of darkness?